How many of you are currently watching this video in the past, present, and future? Master Cycle Time. Oh my god. Zero jump! Zero jump! Zero jump! Zero jump! Holy frick, I get a zero jump. What? This is why? Why? I'm riding a motorcycle. In a Zelda game. Oh, and you can see in the bottom right there's another gauge above the uh right treasure chest gauge. Wait. Oh, if I had a bow and arrow I could probably use it right now. Whoops. <laughs> it's bonk. Whoa! Careful, Link! Oh my god! Do a flip? Oh. Oh, I think I can too! How you doing, Golden Triangles? Alright, I just gotta find a good ramp to do it off of. But I'm, I, I actually can flip myself by the looks of it. Whoa! Okay. I also gotta be careful with this freaking guardian. And I decided to <laughs> encounter. Alright. Let's see. I'm looking for a good staircase. Or a guardian. Oh! Okay, that didn't work. Uh, can I. Is there a reverse on this thing? Uh, is there a reverse on this thing? How do I reverse? No, don't get off. Jump. Oh! There you go, that works. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, he's right there! Whoa! I wonder if this thing can break. Wait, let's find out. Like, break as in, like, get damaged and get destroyed. I doubt it. Whatever. It just got hit off of it, though. Good, 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 good. Oh no, you can only bend back it's so far, you can't do a flip. Whoa, wheelie! <laughs> you can pop a wheelie. Urbosa's fury is ready. Oh, I can just do a wheelie on the spot by holding back. But only for a certain amount of time, alright. Can we drive across the water? Nope. Aw, oh, damn, alright. Alright, let's try different areas to do this in. How about Gruder Desert? I feel like you wouldn't be able to spawn in Gruder Desert, because, like, you can't have a horse in Gruder Desert. We'll defeat Ganon later this episode. Like, re re defeat Ganon and see if there's a different ending. You probably can't do a flip if you screw with physics enough, though. <laughs> Honestly, it feels like that kind of thing. Why well, can't a house be called a home, but a mouse can't be called a moan? That's some good uh, thinking here. Is it faster than the legendary horse? Epona? I'm 100% sure it's faster than a horse. I think, I think it goes the speed. Okay, I can't, I can't use it here, okay. Thought not. I, th I feel like it goes the speed that a horse can go at full speed. Ooh, I wonder, 
Can I have a horse spawn at the same time? I probably can. We can do a bit of a comparison. Of speed. Comparison of speeds. It's so weird that it actually considers this freaking ma master cycle as a divine beast. <laughs> Seems like a bad spot to spawn it though right now. Let's probably go across the water first. I got the ancient bird, but I haven't gotten the ancient saddle yet, so that, that would be like the perfect comparison is comparing it with a horse that has that. Because I believe it makes the horse a little faster, I think. So it gives it more spurs, at least, to jump with move with I mean speed up yeah. oh, they also added a saddle that can teleport your horse to you yeah the ancient saddle I've gotten the ancient burtle but I can't find the saddle I'm struggling I, I'm, I might actually before I do uh, Ganon find a lot more of those other uh, Oh yeah, they said at the start that it spooks horses. I want to see if that's true too. No, nope. right, that was just for. Oh, sorry, Pony. <laughs> what if I could actually kill my horse by running into it for this? All right. So I'm gonna. Brakes. Spin around. Oh, you can turn on the spot just by holding. Okay, the stick. Okay. Get off. Bring my horse over here. Uh, wait. Do I have a, the girl that can add things to your horse? Is that her over there? So I'll put this. I'll put the turtle on. Oh, I can't change it if it's opponent. All right. To get a different horse like aggro. Mm. Oh. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna add it to aggro. Yellow. Oh. Mighty fine horse. Okay. Mm. Ancient Burtle, because I don't have the saddle yet. Ancient Burtle. That adds more spurs. <laughs> but I don't have the saddle yet to add uh, the teleportation ability. I really want to see how it works, though, so. Yeah, see, it has two more now. Oh, Master Cycle gone. He spawned. Alright. Alright, so first we're gonna go. Takes a while to accelerate though. That tree. That seemed pretty fast. But let's see if the opponent can do it much better. you can do the jump off of the motorcycle too, just like you can off of a horse. Ooh, I don't know. The horse actually seems like it might be faster. And also, it was talking about fuel. Before. Actually, I'm going to ride this to locations that, uh, 
type things, but I think it might get faster, like, over time. Or maybe not, I don't know. But you can definitely see, like, a fuel gauge there. Above the chest. My chest, uh, search thing. Talk to the guy in there, see if he talks says anything about my right, sweet right. No, it disappears when I talk to people. Okay. Yeah. It is a dead slow than the horse burn, I think. Which I'm I'm surprised. I thought it would be like this is the freaking best thing you could have in the game, it goes so quickly, but not really actually. That's freaking awesome though, that it can wheelie <laughs> all right what other tests should we each put on this thing got him <laughs> probably equip him to a six turn speed probably it is pretty good speed though If you let go of A, it slows right down. So like a horse, to actually keep going, you have to hold down A. Just, I mean, it's not that hard. But, oh, we're low on fuel. Okay, so how do we put in more fuel? Okay, that's irking me. Okay. I just said you can put in materials in place of it. How about a diamond? Take the diamond. How do you how do you feel? It said put materials in there. Maybe I have to wait till it's all the way depleted or something. I don't know. Whoops! <laughs> I crashed. <laughs> I crashed it. It just disappears when you crash it and knocks you forward. Oh shoot. Ooh, I was close. I'm running low on juice here. Oh no. Whoa! Ah, oh, sweet, sweet tricks. I gotta find all the perfect places to mess around with this thing. Alright. Hey, haven't I, I ride it into a uh, Hyrule Castle? <laughs> I know that I have some stuff to find at Hyrule Castle. Can I just... Oh! Uh, wait, it, show, it shows the uh, fuel right there and... Shows how much it'll refill, but I don't know how to actually use it. Like, I'm looking along the bottom, there's nothing there. Okay, no. Whoops. How do I refuel it? Lord of the Mountain, yeah, I think that is the fastest. I feel certain about that. I think all its stats are, like, maxed. 
Not that you'd be able to tell because it's... <laughs> what? Amber gives it more fuel than diamond. Okay. How do I put it in? Placing materials in its fuel tank. Ha where's the fuel tank? Whoa! I always have an overabundance of this stuff. I always sell it normally. Awesome. 10 amber to refuel. Alright. No. Alright, so let's head in to the castle. I don't have a bunny. Forget. I believe all, all the weapons that they're using on here works exactly like they do. Which, which means that you can. Yeah! <laughs> Frick. <laughs> a lot of buttons, because I also need to hold A. Let's drive over. Yep. A and Y. It's, hold A and Y, and this happens. Do we even the water? No, it damages in the <laughs> net stuff. All right. Oh wait. Should probably first get rid of all the eye things, all the eye things, all the malice. Yeah, but I, I tried to throw the throw food in it before. It didn't work. Like just that, just the same way. So I guess it has to run out of fuel for it to like happen. But then if it's okay, so I guess I have to run out of fuel, and then it gives you the option to be able to do that. And now, and then from then on, you can always do it. I don't know. That's, I'm assuming that's how the game is using it. I love how the Master Cycle Zero is actually a room. Oh. Master Cycle's in the way. <laughs> yeah, I just hit it out of the way. That's fine. This is freaking crazy. I can't believe this is in the game right now. Go inside. Oh yeah, just like the... Just like horses, it, it just stops you. Try putting one apple in. Oh, while I was looking at the chat, apparently the master cycle disappeared. Try putting one apple in it. Alright. How much do apples refuel it? Enough amount to, uh. I think it might be worth it. I remember I was. I was behind it. When I, I tried to throw it in the back, because that's like. I think that's where fuel is in actual bikes. It did open up there, so I think that I think that I'm right with that. Oh, I'm getting, getting called up here back.
And I'm back, sorry. Well, it's slowly backing up. Don't do that. Okay. How am I gonna get around this? Guess I gotta do this. Back offers some nice advantages, and yet there's still a reason to use a horse. Really nice advanced. True. That is true right there. But I, that said, I'm still probably going to use the, only the bike now, <laughs> from now on. <laughs> oh, shoot. Is he going to spawn? No, okay. That was interesting. It just the game just kind of stopped for a little bit there. I'm gonna save that. Whoa! Why is the game lagging? There's something wrong with using a bike. Game, are you bike sist? God, why does the game keep lagging like this? What's going on? Something about using the Master Cycle in Hyrule Castle, it probably just hurts the game. For some reason. You want to be best for the game to load the area. Yeah, I went through this whole place with a horse and it didn't, didn't do that. Alright. So, I want to find out if the game has a different ending, so I think I'm just going to kill Ganon quick. Shouldn't take that long. Not that hard. It doesn't have a different ending? Oh, okay. Well, thanks for letting me know. So I didn't have to... Has finally come. Brace yourself, Ganon, for the sting of my revenge. Cause it seems like it, it seemed like it would. Like at the end, it like basically told you. Now you have the power to defeat Ganon. So I'm like, oh, is it gonna have a different ending? <laughs> I want to see this again, though. This part is too good not to see. No, 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 it seemed to hint about it though. That's what. Irks me. Well, thanks for saving me from disappointment. <laughs> Alright, that's good enough. Can't leave right now. No, because of jet delay, it's I guess it's too late now. I can probably load an old save though. Yeah, okay. Never mind, it's not too late. Alright, time to do more uh Some more testing with the master cycle and other things. All right, drive the horse back out. No, actually, I don't really feel like that. Um, let's just find more. Let's find that sort that saddle. Let's find the horse saddle.
So it was this one. So I did. It, uh, I got I got one right under the cherry the cherry blossom tree where creatures gather, and the other is at the spring where the horse spirit resides. Both of those sound like they're in the same exact spot. I found the I found one right next to the spring where the horse fierce horse, horse spirit resides, but it was also underneath of a. Uh, it was underneath of a uh, cherry blossom too, so it like it's both. It covers both, so that's what's really confusing me. I really want to find that because that seems like it's a very big part of the game, <laughs> you know, very big part of the uh, DLC. I need to find the rest of the uh, added uh, side quest things to find new uh, things in the game. What else do I have left? The rest of the Royal Guard. The Garb of Wing Winds. This one confused me because I couldn't... I looked everywhere on the map. There was no Minoite River. And the Dark Armor. I forget where the Dark Armor is. I know they showed us all the things that they have. Oh! Phantom Ganon. Right. Okay. So that'll take a while to find. But for now, we need. To, I'm gonna finish off horse rumors. But I have chest tracking on right now, so I, to help me. That's I. I use chest tracking too to try to help me find it, and I could not find it. So I was wondering if that was just Cherry Mountain, but I. Uh, that must have been just okay. I'm getting called. I'll be right back. Lord, everyone's calling me about the same dang thing. Just gotta tell them all the same exact thing. Alright. Am I going the wrong way? Did I teleport to the wrong spot? I teleported to the wrong spot. No idea how I did that. <laughs> I'm like, wait a second, this is not the right mountain. In fact, I don't think it was a mountain. So, how's, how excited are you for uh, Bayonetta 3? <laughs> are you not really a fan or something? Or are you hyped? I'm in between. Like... Like Jesus. <laughs> Jesus Christ is another Bayonetta game. But on the other hand, I've never even played a Bayonetta game, so it's hard to get excited. I haven't talked about it yet, though, so I didn't mention it. Uh, apparently, I'm going towards the treasure chest. Was I just an idiot? And it was over here also, and I just missed it somehow. It's apparently, just this way. 
Oh, hi. Wait, I'm using the ceremony. Oh my god. Why have I been doing it? See, I saw. I found one. Right underneath of this cherry blossom. And then the other one is in a spring where here the spirit resides. That's right here, too. So. Interesting. Never got it for the Wii U. I almost got it for Wii U. But I didn't. Might get it for Switch. Never played Bayo. Yeah. I'm intrigued. I want to do blind playthroughs of it. Like I did blind playthroughs of uh, the Metroid Prime games. In preparation for Metroid Prime 4. I, I might have to do Bayonetta 1 or 2 playthroughs in preparation for <laughs> Bayonetta 3. I'm in the same exact situation as I was that I was at the start when Metroid Prime 4 was announced. As I have, as I am for Metroid Prime, Metroid, uh, Bayonetta 3 being announced. But, but, like, what? Under a cherry blossom tree, uh, at a mountain where creatures gather. Creatures gather here, like right in this spot. And I found it under a cherry blossom tree. The other is at a spring where a horse spirit resides. Also right here, but it's not right here. So where is it? Okay, I'm just gonna follow the marker, the, the thing on my, uh, like, chest detection thing. Where, how far does it want me to go? Where is it trying to make me go? Have I been going backwards? No, oh, it is down. It says it is down. Oh my god, it's in the mountain, maybe. Fairy fan. Oh. True. Okay. Wait, am I below it now? Yeah, okay. Whatever. That is true, I didn't think of that. That actually, you know, how did I not think of that, actually? Like, I'm realizing that that's actually, that actually seems quite obvious, now that I think of it. <laughs> Whatever. Is this a Korok? <laughs> All right. Not sure I didn't find that before, but have it now. But that would make sense, uh, because both areas like are like horse shrine kind of things. It'd be where you find the horse armor, you know? It's perfect. Okay, this is taking forever. <laughs> Let's speed it up a bit, why don't we? And this is the plus of having a master cycle. You don't need to, to be near your horse to be able to call it in. Just summon it right in front of you. Whoa! No fall damage. Good to know. <laughs> Probably. That might not have been enough fight. So, still could be fall damage, but... <laughs> Just as good as... The horse is at killing creatures on the way. And I'm going towards the chest right now, too, so that's. That's a very obvious sign. What? Got right back on it? No. 
Wait, is it actually going to be in the spring? Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Behind it. Aha, there. Thanks for the hint. Or uh, if you didn't know. Actually, it looks like you didn't know. Thanks for helping me out. There it is. Oh, whoops. This is just so cool. Cars, I mean, ma not car, motorcycle, but close enough. In a Zelda game. Like, we thought it was crazy enough that Link was <laughs> riding a motorcycle in a Mario Kart 8. Now he's doing it in an actual Zelda game. Like, what? <laughs> I also like how they named this after the uh his uh cart in Mario Kart 8. Master Cycle. Master Cycle Zero. Whoa! Sick tricks. Pop a wheelie. Makes himself look cool. Getting shot at. It's alright. No worries. You're on a bike. Can't hit you. Wait, you don't mind what? I feel like I said something, but I don't remember it now. Oh, that Link is riding a horse and uh, riding a motorcycle in a Zelda game. I think that's what you're referring to. It's surprisingly fitting. Like, I did not expect this to fit. <laughs> the bike, yeah. I did not expect this to fit. Do the other game. Okay, I thought it'd be knocked off right there. But it really does. Out of way! <laughs> Make way! Make way for Link on a freaking motorcycle. Last thing you'd expect coming your way! Oh, Jesus! Damn it. Some Zelda fans hate it? Really? That I haven't seen around very much. Hate for this. For myself. Alright. The true test to see if there is no fall damage. For the, uh, Master Psycho Zero. True test. I'm just gonna name the video that I'm recording for YouTube, uh, Screwing with the Master Cycle. It was gonna be beating Ganon, seeing if there was a second ending. But no, it's just screwing around with the Master Cycle. <laughs> they thought, hey, Link's rode a bike before. Might as well do it again. I want, to, I want to see Jacob's reaction. My friend Jacob, who hey, does not like this Zelda game. He loves Zelda games, but he doesn't like this Zelda game. He says it's too boring. Which I disagree with. Fully, but whatever. I want to see his reaction to freaking... I guess I haven't seen his reaction yet to the uh, bike. Being in the game. Since he said himself he's not going to beat the games, which means he's not going to be able to play the DLC, I'm going to just draw the bike to him next time I see him. Alright, 
right, so now I'm done with the champion's ballot. I'm gonna replace my uh, map marker where it was before. My uh, frick, what do you call it? Travel medallion back where it was. At the very tip top of this mountain. So I can jump off whenever I want. Alright. Ready for the true test. It's not something I would like to see every game from now on. Okay. Oh, eventually it kicks you off. Okay. If you fall far enough, it will just kick you off. Alright. Yeah, I think... I, I feel like it's more of a DLC kind of thing. It, it definitely... I don't think it would have fit right in the game from the start. Like, it definitely feels better as a DLC item. Whoa! Craziness is happening. An endgame item. Ugh. Stone Talus here. Or I guess Frost Talus, as it's called here. Sorry about that. Rivali's Gale is now ready. We're starting to run out of fuel. I'm gonna refill it. Dude, I'm gonna run out of materials quick. <laughs> trying to refuel this thing. I'm gonna have to go on a lot of material uh, trips. No one's forcing me to use it. True. But I guess they don't like that. The, the fact that it's even in the game as an option. I don't know. I like it though. I can see. I can. I can kind of see people not liking it. But I like it. Uh, but I, I may not have been a Zelda fan for that long now, but it's still my favorite series. I'm fine with it. I'm more than fine with it. I love it. <laughs> so do you. Yeah. Dude, this, this is my favorite place to ride this. Whoa! Oh, stop, stop! Ah! This place was made for shield surfing, <laughs> which makes it riding around in the shield surfing areas so much more fun. You don't have the DLC yet? Ah, uh, that. Whoa! Ow! Oh no! Ow! <laughs> Link involved in car accident. I guess, motorcycle accident. He <laughs> landed on the bike. That's funny. All right, off I go. Shoot, this is far. Ow! That was a really far, just far distance to fall. Well, I'm gonna need to restock on full heals. On full heals, this second playing Pokemon. Whoa! Ooh, backwards! Don't go backwards. That's not. Oh shoot! Am I stuck here? Just roll. Just roll. <laughs> he downhill on it. It's empty. Well, I'm not using acceleration right now, so I'm assuming so. Oh, hey there. Ow. I'm going to teleport back to the top. Uh, but I would definitely assume so. Uh, I'll test that, though. I'll run it out of... I'll run it out. No. Write it back down. I'll try to write it back down. I'll spawn it on a slope and then ride it down the mountain. Because that could be awesome. 
coasting uh, some uh, fuel efficiency there. You're welcome. It's all about it's all about the testing right now. You got a new vehicle in the game, we gotta test it out, man. I mean, we got, we got a new vehicle in a Zelda game. That's not even something that I would have thought I would have said ever. But let's ride it down this uh, shield surfing slope. Also, I'm pretty sure this is an area that you can't normally bring a horse to, so this is also very new. Dude, my friend. Oh, my! You know, my friend. My friend disliked this game, cause he he's like a simulation game kind of person. He said one of the reasons he hates this game is because you can't ride anything but a horse. But now you can ride a motorcycle. I mean, it might not be a car that he wants to drive, but it's a motorcycle nonetheless. <laughs> he's not gonna like it because he can't fly a plane. Like he likes games like GTA and stuff like that, farming sim. <laughs> not really a gamer. More like a normal person that also likes to play games that simulate things that you can do in real life. I don't know. But I'm definitely going to point this out to him and see. I wonder if he uses more fuel up or downhill. That would be interesting. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! I missed! <laughs> it's alright. I can still go this way. You can ride a, a bear and deer also. Yeah. That's true, but... You also complain that those are just living things. <laughs> that you're riding. This, though, is a motorcycle. You can't even argue with this. This is, this is a motorcycle. This is... This is a freaking dirt bike. <laughs> looking thing. There's no denying that. Let me try going uphill now. See if that takes up much more fuel. I feel doubtful that it would. I think it's just the amount of time that you're moving, but who knows. The other animals also. Uh, I don't think so, actually. I think it is just deer. Maybe moose. Actually, I haven't really tried with moose. Let's try it. Do some extra testing here. I don't think you can ride a moose. But, trying to think of it, I've never tried it before. I'll just put that on so I have at least a little bit of sneak. I do like it. You don't see me. What are you talking about, dog? <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, I think. Uh, actually, I'm not sure. I feel like that's something that's like hard to measure without like an actual like timer. It's almost out of fuel. I can also see how ridiculous he looks in different clothing while on it. Dude, ever wanted to see Tingle riding a motorcycle? <laughs> Who is really cold? Well, you're in luck. Because. <laughs> have you ever wanted to see. Link in a tingle out here riding a motorcycle. Well, <laughs> we got the game for you. <laughs> I'm taking damage. Why did I put that on? Okay. Uh, just putting the different outfits while he's on a motorcycle just makes it so much better. Alright, there it goes. 
doesn't roll down the hills. While, uh... It'll probably be faster just to teleport to time. It doesn't roll down the hill, I think, while it's... While I'm off of it. I think it would be while I'm on it, though. Right there on that angle. Test this thing's fuel efficiency. All right, let's go. Not not holding A. I can't hold A because that don't have any fuel. Dude, this is this is it's going like a good speed too. This is perfect. I mean, I don't have as good of handling on it. I can tell. Like I can feel like when I'm turning, it's like not turning as well because it's like because it's just free rolling. It's like real life. I don't. You don't have as, mu as much control over it because you're not the one who's moving it. But you can still do it. it still works. Are we still wheelie? No. Okay. Let's find the test. <laughs> we cannot still wheelie. Going down the whole mountain like this. Oh. I think it's slowing down. So not as much of a slope now. We need a steeper slope right now. We still kill wolves. Still kill wolves. Yep. Ah, uh, slow me down. Good. We're still fine. We're still moving. Faster than shield surf. I could probably get a timer on the uh, on the computer so we can perform some of these tests with actual, with some accuracy. Something to let us know if we're right or wrong. Yeah, we go down this pretty good still. I love how it leaves a trail in the snow, too. Alright. Oh, it shows it on the map, too. Even though it disappears quickly. <laughs> It'll still show it on the map. Alright. I'm actually going to get up a timer here. Stopwatch. <laughs> Google has a stopwatch right here. Alright, full screen it. Actually, no, don't full screen it because I want to be able to see the chat still. Does the jump work? Ooh, I didn't test that. I feel doubtful that it would, but I don't we don't know until we test. So I'll go down on the mountain a little bit. And then we'll just walk back up. And then we'll start the uh, speed testing. Nope. Jump does not work. You see, it stops rolling the moment we get off of it. That's realistic. This just puts on the parking brakes automatically. Oh, come on, really? Alright. So first off, let's test shield surfing. Okay. Let's wait until daytime so we don't have to deal with not just spawning on the trail. <laughs> parking brake, yeah. Automatic parking brake. I'm gonna wait before lighting it. <laughs> I don't know if the uh, blood moon will do anything about the campfire, so I'm just gonna wait. Yeah. 
Alright. Get her stopwatch ready. I'm gonna put it on a different window. No. Minimize it. Okay. Make it smaller. So I can only see the stopwatch. There we go. So we're going to try it with it, uh, the Hylian shield. Because I know that uh, some types of shields can go further. Like the... Uh, I don't have any shields that can go faster. But like... Shields that glide that go better, like ancient shields and stuff, they they slide a lot better. I've noticed. Like I've done extensive testing and to find out, like I've gone, I've tried to slide down staircases. Uh, all the shields except for the guardian and um, the guardian shields and ancient shields and all that stuff, they go like maybe one or two steps, sometimes three. The guardian ones can go all the way down staircases. Okay, so this is, I'm gonna be hard. It's gonna be hard to do this with two hands here. Okay. Like I have my, <laughs> like it's gonna take two hands to start shield, start shield surfing. But then it's gonna take another hand. Okay, I'm gonna put one finger on the start. You didn't know that. I have short-term memory. I just realized that I don't even know what I was talking about just then. <laughs> I <laughs> I'm so bad at remembering what I'm trying to say. What was I saying that you s that you didn't know? All right, I gotta get ready. Oh, the guardian shields, right? <laughs> like I always remember after asking what I was saying. Yeah, the guardian shields. Yeah, they go better. Different shields go faster. Yeah. <laughs> I remember it right before you tell me, too. Alright. Like, every time, that's what happens. Okay. Go. And start. There we go. So, I'm gonna go left here. I'm gonna try to remember what pathway I'm taking so that I can recreate it. Uh, I'm gonna go right here. Stay right. Uh, I guess stay right. Alright, and I'm gonna stop it right when we hit the shadow of that tree. Of that, uh. Of this overhead. The moment we touch the shadow of it. Which might be different at different points of the day, so. I gotta go quick. So that was 45 seconds. That there was 45 seconds. Now we're gonna try it with the Master Cycle without fuel, and then we're gonna try it with the Master Cycle with fuel. Ads. Like advertisements. Twitch ad. See, it's an advertisement playing right now. So you can't see my stream right now. But because of the way you're probably hearing me saying this. Even so. I'm assuming. <laughs> Hard to tell how how much delays there is going to be. Sometimes there's a lot. Sometimes there's a little. What was the time? Okay, it was 45 seconds. We did it in 45 seconds. Okay, this one's gonna be a lot easier because it takes one. Okay. It takes one hand to hop onto the bike. Three, two, one, go. So I, I went left first, correct? Wait, and then right. Frick. Already screwing it up. I don't think it matters that much. But I think I went pretty much all the way right. Hmm. 
being shot at. So a Twitch ad played right when I was okay. That's funny. And stop. Forty-eight seconds. So it took slightly longer to do it without fuel. But now we're gonna refuel it, and we're gonna see what the time is without the fuel. With the fuel, I mean. Actually, like accelerating down the hill. I could like do OBS magic and yeah, it's about the same, but slightly. It was slightly slower. Technically. This is probably gonna be much faster. With fuel. There we go. Go. Oh shoot, I didn't reset it. Okay, frick. Okay, I already screwed it up. Alright, sorry, back up the hill. <laughs> Let's start again. I didn't reset the timer. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna hop on coast. I'm thinking you meant coast. Yeah, coast with fuel versus none. Yeah, we'll do that next. Go. Ah, shoot. I right clicked, which paused it. I right clicked and left clicked at the same time. I'm screwing this up. Okay. Let's try this once more. Get a hoff. Okay. Reset. Start. That time it worked. Okay. The timing is looking not very good. We're going to see what it is by the end, though. Oh, maybe it's not. It's right there, the end. Okay, got a one hand whole day while I stop the timer the moment I touch the. Okay, and one hand. I can use my palm to steer it. <laughs> Ooh, 46 seconds. Faster, but not much faster. Stream is dropping frames, getting choppy. Oh, shoot. Um, OBS isn't. It's not OBS's fault. OBS is still running fine. I might just end the stream and restart it. Like, stop and then start again. It'll Maybe it'll fix it itself. So I'll be right back. Just a second. Still recording now. Probably doesn't take any fuel too. So this is a good fuel efficiency work right here. What about the cliff? Whoa! Oh, this is crazy. Dude, crazy steep slopes. Oh, we're daredeviling it here. Dang it, that was a little bit of bad. A little bit of a bad. <sighs> so cool.
Whoa! Hey there. Oh, God, water. <laughs> Teleport the Divine Beast of our Meadow. I'm gonna drive it off the cliff. Okay. You followed? And then the follower, uh, thing should pop up if you did. Because I do have a follower notification on OBS, unless I missed it. Oh, wait, I think I removed it. Wait. I might be gone right now. Ah, oh, I can't use it up here. Okay. That's fine, I guess. I have so much more... <laughs> so many more pathways going down the mountain now. Alright, so I'm going to try going around maybe on the Great Plateau with it. That could be fun. Wait, if I can't spawn it in the Gerudo Desert... Uh, actually, it's probably the same with the horse. I, I thought maybe I could drive it off. Drive it off of the uh, ledge, but uh, I realized the horse is an invisible wall for horses, so it'll probably be the same way. But thanks for following. Ah, it'd be cool to see you in future streams. Uh, today, later today, I'm probably going to be streaming uh, stuff with my friend. So my friend's coming over later today. Uh. Oh, is there? Can I go back into the dungeon? Is that an option here? It has fulfilled its duty. It slumbers peacefully. So what does this do this time? Does it put me back in the dungeon? I'm curious. Woo! I want to see some of my Master Cycle videos that I've taken now. Test game mechanics, yeah. This is pretty much gonna be like exclusive for testing the master cycle. I don't like to, I don't I don't usually test a lot of things in games unless I'm like one of the first people to do it like now. Like it literally came out yesterday or the day before yesterday, whatever. You know what? It's close enough. I think I'm gonna post this one and call it wipeout. That's good. 
But I mostly do like blind playthroughs of games I haven't, I've never played before, or I do some just for fun replaythroughs like Super Mario Galaxy 2. I'm doing, I'm doing a Super Mario Odyssey playthrough. I'm doing a Breath of the Wild Master Mode blind playthrough, like blind in terms of, like I don't know what's gonna appear in Master Mode, different and stuff like that, which I haven't actually gotten too far in, so. Time to post. Uh, but I'm doing a blind playthrough of Metroid Prime 2 right now. I've already finished Metroid Prime 1. Good ways to do that. I'm going to do Metroid Prime 3 after that. Eventually I'll do Bayonetta 1 too. Uh, if you go down below the stream I have a you have, if you click the three pictures down there you need to play Prime 2 Prime 2 has been fantastic so far but you, I have my stream schedule I'm trying to get my stream schedule back up it used to be it used to be full of stuff I post on Twitter when I'm streaming and I upload uh, to YouTube I have videos that aren't streamed and I but a lot of my videos are archives from streams. It's a mixture. Oh, I need to test out, uh, I need to test out the, uh, horse saddle, I forgot. So I, g right, because I mentioned that, oh, but the master's like, you can summon it anywhere, but now you'll be able to do that with horses, too. I don't know where the panels appear. Two new interactions on Twitter. What may they be? People liking and retweeting my, uh... Oh, yeah, it does bring you back down to the dungeon. All right. Hey, Korok's not here anymore. What the frick, dog? Can I leave? Leave this area. My bad. Well, you didn't get to see anything about it, so that's fine. You came in right after I was done with the uh, boss, though. So, the boss of the dungeon. Oh, wow. 
goodness gravy. Oh, you just wanted to see someone ride the bike? Well, I guess you came in just in time for me to get the bike and try it out. You don't want any spoilers, alright. I won't show off anything more of that. Because that was just me testing whether or not I could go back in, too. Oh my gosh, lag. It doesn't expect you to have like a, something to go fa as fast as a horse on the plateau. Because there's a lot more besides that. There was, there was like seven hours or so of gameplay. Like it takes forever. Oh! It was just the bike. Your icon, my icon? Okay. So that means you came in right when I started spawning that bike. Alright, so what else can we do? Oh yeah, the saddle. Uh, I had to reset stable. Or outskirt stable, sorry. Reset stable. Yeah, outskirt uh, skirt stable is the one I was trying to say. You're the only one with the bike on Twitch at the time. Really? Only? That's pretty sweet. Yeah, sorry about that. Slice spoiler then. You didn't get to see what the inside of it looked like though, sorry. Sorry about showing you where it was though. Yeah, this wasn't actually meant to be a testing the bike stream, it was a blind playthrough of the DLC pack. But you luckily came in right. <laughs> Sorry, Beetle. You luckily came in right when I started going using the bike, though. But, like, with you saying there's not a new ending, I. That kind of made me assume that you had already seen everything. Right. Oh, hoy! <laughs> oh. Right, my horse isn't nearby. All right. Oh. See, I don't want aggro to be the one with all this gear on, though. Like, I don't want to keep all this gear on aggro. Because aggro is my, my aggro is my baby. You wouldn't know Aggro if you haven't played Shadow of the Colossus, but Aggro is, Aggro is the best horse. He used to be the best horse in all of gaming for me. Like, the best horse physics. You don't know anything except the bike. Alright. Oh wait, not the burrow. Uh... I don't know why I tried to change the burrow. Change the saddle. I'm done. So how would one... Do I just have to whistle and it'll teleport to me? That's probably how it works. This makes for quite the OP horse. Wait, can I also give it Endura Carrots to increase it even more? I wonder. Oh my god, yes, it does! Oh my god! <laughs> so many spurs, so many spurs. Yeah, I feel like the horse is slower though. I don't know why. Maybe I'm used to riding a bike. I don't know. 
I didn't even see those bursts. <laughs> But I guess this makes aggro even better of a horse, so I guess I'll keep it on. But Shadow of the Colossus had, used to have the best horse riding in gaming for me until Breath of the Wild came along. Much better horse. Uh, like, it, it still has the whole Shadow of the Colossus thing where the horse doesn't exactly follow your every command. But as it likes you more, it will follow your command better. That I really love. As well as the whole, like, automatically dodging things and following pathways. And then this game's horses can you know, the horse can actually swim unlike in Shadow of the Colossus where the horse just avoids water. But let's uh Yeah, I love I love that. There's people who complain about that because it makes it too easy to traverse to tra to traverse. Never play Shadow. But do you know anything about it? Because that's a game that you want to play through blind. <laughs> Which I, I never got since I got into it through videos. And then I played it. And then they're making the remake, too, soon. Okay, I'm going to wait till I'm really far away from my horse and I'm going to call him. I also love the light. The freaking spotlight. Or I guess a headlight, as it would be called on the front of a car. Or, sorry, bike. So now do I whistle it and it'll automatically come? Yep! That is awesome. Fight giants. That's all you know? Yeah, that's a snippet of the lore. But yeah, I basically love it for the music and the giants and like the, the story section at the end. Whoa, a quirk I haven't found yet. That's rare. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, the horse aggro in Java Colossus. At the moment I caught a black horse, I, need, I needed to name it aggro. That is freaking awesome. So many spurs. Even though the Endura Carrot ones are just temporary, they're good for like if you're out of if you're out of speed ups and there's a guardian about to shoot you, you can still speed up. You're not just gonna get hit. You still get the overworld music on the bike. Uh, I'm gonna say no. Definitely no. We, I've been riding the bike so much. If the overworld music would appear, I would have heard it. But I can try. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely you know it would have kicked in by now. I'm starting right out of fuel again. I, sh I, I need to go mining on Death Mountain more often now, so I can actually have a lot more fuel for this. Get a lot more amber. But that would have been a nice addition to hear over world music still on the bike. It also does not follow the pathway, which I kind of... I, I thought... I thought that would happen, because it's not a horse. It does not sentient. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Too late. Ooh. Team star. Ah! Oh my god! 
<laughs> it shot itself, so it shot again. I'm about to run out of fuel. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, good lord. Okay, how much... Mighty minutes fill up quite a bit. I will go bunch into those. Where did that shooting start from? I can't see the line in the sky. Yeah, it definitely does not treat the bike like a horse like I expected. Like it's nowhere near treated as a horse. It's a completely separate entity from horses. No! Oh! What did I just kill? <laughs> it sounded like a friggin' chipmunk. What? Try to do a trick off of this guardian. I like that doesn't call a path. No reason to use a horse. True. Oh, sick tricks. Not really. <laughs> but it does use the the weapon system as it does in the horse. Yeah, bice is nicely balanced over horse. I agree. Whoa. But, like, I love how they call, they call the jump zero jump. It's not a jump, it's a zero jump. I should probably get out of Hyrule Field with this thing, because there's just guardians everywhere. Oh my god, another one. Right next to a freaking Hynax. Oh, can you hit the Hynax for me? <laughs> okay. I love how it shot the Hynax just like directly. Like, what is that thing? Why? Why is this the thing that is happening right now? How do I combat this? Oh, shoot. I was mashing A like I was on a horse. Freaking horse combat. This is freaking awesome. That was dead. Yeah, I finished off the Guardian. Good combat. <laughs> So did the Hynox have a bow on him? That's really all I want. Yeah, bow. I don't care about the rest. That was freaking sweet. Alright, what else can we do? I feel like we definitely won't be able to ride in Death Mountain. <laughs> Dude, it, it, we can ride it across Akala's hills. I love the hills of Akala. Like, they're such gentle, gentle but huge hills. That'll be fun to ride the horse on. Or, motorcycle. Master cycle. As they like to call it. Ah.
All right. Oh, also. I wish to purchase some stuff from ye. Oh, I don't have any arrows. Okay, so I can't do that. That's fine. I'm gonna buy two. What other thing also needs a giant ancient core? I feel like one other did. Yeah, the ancient shield. I'm gonna also buy that. Slideborn Rain? Oh, the Master Cycle. That's it. Slideborn Rain. Let's find out. That would be really cool. Oh, I think it does. It's are you feeling like a slight lack of control? Oh, I think I'm just imagining it actually. I'm getting a feel for it. No, it doesn't feel like it slides a lot in rain at all. Maybe on rock it will. It's only not in dirt. Did I buy another shield? Or did I only buy one? I only bought one. That's probably good. Probably for the best. So I don't think it does. Might might on might on rock. I can test it on rock. Oh, I love when I make the jump, but I still like nick it, so it bounces me up a little higher. All right, we can do some fuel efficiency here and not not hit the gas on the way down this hill. Whoops! Ah! Oh, Jesus. I fell into the spring of power on accident. I'm almost out of fuel. Get out of this. Ah! Can I just kill a fox? I thought that was a guardian looking at me like that light on the wall. I'm like, wait, whoa. Okay, I can't get out like that. Ow! <laughs> Alright, can I refuel this? I'm gonna try to refill it all the way. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Refill it. Okay, one more. Okay, that's enough. More than enough, in fact. Ah! Whoa, it's close. Get me the heck out of here. I think I can use any material too, but the I, I noticed that the uh, the bananas filled up quite quick. Oh, rock! <laughs> Apples are probably best since they're so common, but they fill it up at different by different amounts. Is the thing. So like. I can see a larger amount. Oh wait, no, maybe not. Whoops. Like, that doesn't fill it up very much. Oh, now it is that. Oh, because it's full. It's not going to fill it up very much. Okay. But I'm pretty sure the, uh, Mighty Man has filled it up a lot more. Now I have a lot of the rooms, so I feel like it's better to use those right now. 
Because I feel like I'll burn through all my apples really quick. Yeah, but it has a different effect when going through water. Through, like, the water in the rain. Oh, dude, I know where to go. It goes to the Akala Low Grounds, or whatever they call them, wetlands. Down here. Tor and wetland, okay. Because down there, when it's raining, actually, like, water... Uh... Water actually rises out of the ground, like puddles. Like, I want to actually fight enemies like this right now. There we go. I'm starting to run out of shock at oh, Don't want to go back in the spring of courage. Well, I just instinctually switched to holding ZR there for a little bit. Trying to make that work. See, in other games, you know, ZR is forward and stuff. Fury Rush when getting airtime. Wait, so I can do this, jump off, and. Oh, wait, oh, I know what you mean. Like, jump off a cliff and then in midair try to aim the arrow. I think that's what you're trying to say. Like, while I'm on the bike, aim the arrow while I'm in the air. Okay. That's a really cool idea. I like that. Uh, when I jump down to the wetlands, I'll do that. Actually, I have a better idea on how to get that, on, on how to do that. Thanks for that suggestion. That's a really good suggestion. Dude, what if I went up to the top of Akala Citadel? Oh, there's the, uh... Wetlands I was talking about, but it's not gonna rain for a while, so... We'll test that later. There's also a couple Guardians in there to fight. That'll be fun. Even though horses are still, like, just as good, if not better, as, than, uh, this Master Cycle, uh, I'm still probably gonna use the Master Cycle a lot more, just because it's new. Like, I want to get more Zelda time in. Like, my favorite game of all time, I want to, I want to play it a lot more often. Like, what's your favorite game of all time? Golden Triangles. You can just call you gold. <laughs> a lot easier. Look okay, at how much time do you have in it. Whoa, I didn't even mean to pop that wheel. Okay, so how how am I gonna get this thing up there? I'm probably just gonna summon it while I'm up there. It's a hard question for you. Hmm. For me, it's either this game or Shadow of the Colossus. I feel like this game is won me over. Like, especially with this even more content right here. I feel like this game is now my favorite of all time. Oh, I meant to jump off right before I hit the wall, but nope. <laughs> Bonk. Alright, I'm going to head up to the top of the Citadel. Oh, hey, would you look at that? Oh, it's not a chest. All right, just ore. Ah, good. Amber for refilling my, uh, Master Cycle Zero. Always a good thing. My favorite game of all time used to be, uh, Super Mario 3D World. Not very common opinion. But it is mine. It was mine, at least. 
And it's still one of my favorite games of all time, of course. Why wouldn't it be here? Why would it just stop? Yeah, it does like the structure of all those other games. A lot of the moments that like would have cutscenes, there isn't cutscenes. It, it like you just walk into it. Like the uh, one of my main examples I like to give people, the encountering of the Forgotten Temple. That like, in any other Zelda game, if you when you encounter that, it would like initiate a cutscene, some dialogue and stuff from whatever your partner is and stuff. It'd probably be a lot like. But no, you just like it would probably it would probably have a lot more structure to it and all that. But no, in, in this game you just walk up to it. You create your own adventure. It doesn't like force you, force Link to walk up to it and talk to something and stuff. And then, you know, you just walk in. You do the thing. You build your own story around it. And I think that's what a lot of people like. They're used to being having their hand held through this stuff to like make it a more epic experience by like actually giving it more of a feel to it. But in this game, it's more like create your own adventure. There's no cutscenes going into different areas for the most part. It's all just your own interpretation. Uh, my friend wants me to ask my aunt something just a second. Alright. I like bre after that after that hand holding mess that was Skyward Sword, I think Nintendo wanted to step too far. Went just a step too far and to choose your own adventure. I guess you could say it's a bit too far, but that's for certainly what a lot of people feel. Like people think that it has too few cutscenes. The cutscenes are Basically, just all memories. Oh, I was gonna go over the memories, but there's spoilers in there for Champions Ballad. Uh, it's not the way I was supposed to go, is there? But it just, just the idea that there was a, like a giant event that happened 100 years ago. I love that, that idea. <laughs> Sorry. I want to try to jump off from the top. Oh, shoot. I'm not going to make that. I thought there was a spiral pathway up. Can't find it. No, I didn't mean to call my friend. Okay. Shoot. I like Breath of the Wild, but I don't really remember any WoW moments. I remember when I started the first dungeon, when I beat my first dungeon, and I, I uh, really got the feel of, like, there's so much that happened 100 years ago that, like, you know, remember, like, and everyone from 100 years ago, they're all, like, counting on you. It just had... It just like struck me. I, like I love when I have that. Like it's usually within the first ten days that I get a game that if it becomes one of my favorites of all time, it like there like there's usually one moment that just strikes me, and I realize that this is the, like, how good the game is. A few traditional dungeons. Yeah, I agree. More traditional dungeons. I want. 
But my friend who doesn't like the game said that he likes the new dungeon idea. It's the new dungeon style more than traditional dungeon style. He said he didn't like the game just because it's just flat out boring. The moment-to-moment the -moment gameplay. So let's try your idea. Jumping off. In fact, so I don't have to wait. I could have just teleported up to the top of the tower anyways. Okay. And there's rain on the uh, schedule now. Which side should, you, should I jump from? Okay, another text. I like the shrines and the divine beasts. They were cool, but they were short. I kind of agree. But the shrines like they Whoa. Oh hi, 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 hi. That you guys know you guys were here. Okay. the maze shrines, the labyrinth, oh, the labyrinth, yeah, I, some of these shrines, like, the puzzles were freaking awesome, that's what they are, just quick snippets of puzzles, rather than full-on dungeons of puzzles, and I guess that's the way they can get away with having the shrines be, that the dungeons be so short, is because all the shrines, like, are a lot of the uh, puzzles. But I feel like the uh, dungeon length, it's, it's like just enough. And I, I didn't like at first that the, uh, the four bosses of the dungeons were like, like the same thing. For the most part. And the music were like, was like the same, but it like felt like poetry when I actually went through it. So like, from before the game came out, I thought that was really stupid. But it's one of the things that have turned my one of my favorite things about the game. But are you ready to test this out? Oh yeah! You so can! That is freaking awesome. <laughs> Two to four traditional dungeons. That would have fit in. But if the rumors are true and they're adding even more DLC in, in the future, which I wouldn't be surprised by, you can't do that on a horse. I'm. 100% certain that you can't do that on a horse. <sighs> Whoops! I jumped off the horse on accident. <laughs> er, sorry. Bike. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. <sighs> Damn. Just in the bike despawned from the fall. I can try it on a horse. <laughs> what is can I do that from like a low jump? No, okay. You have to actually have a substantial jump to it. Oh. Again, I'm holding ZR. Holding ZR again. Good gravy.
<laughs> it's just weird looking. Have some good aim right there. Like, I was trying to get a good jump off of a guardian. Damn, alright. I thought, I thought that would be high enough. Two in a row, dude. That was a good. No giant 18 cores? Alright. But this would be really fun to drive through when, uh... When the rain starts coming down and there's gonna be rain. There's gonna be water flying everywhere as I'm driving through it. But for now, let's try out the horse. Let's try let's try doing that on the horse. I, I, I know that if you fall for just a little bit on a horse, it'll force you off of the horse. And the horse will fall and die. So I'm gonna save before doing this and I'm gonna, like, reload the old save. Because I don't want Aggro to die. I don't want it to waste some uh, Endura carrots to bring him back. Oh, yeah, Wolfling. I wonder how Wolfling keeps up with uh, keeps up with the bike. I can test that too. Probably just the same as the horse, where it just he just legs behind. <laughs> Tell has to tell us to teleport back every now and then, and then eventually just leaves. But I still want to try it out. You like a game similar to Majora's Mask where you can play it as others besides Link. When you say it was the trailer for DLC 2, I owe. Like, I. I feel like what's going on with that is that, like, enters too close to. I thought we were going to play as the champions. That's what other people thought too, when I'm. I never thought that. I was like. Why would you be able to do that? was like my thinking whenever anyone thought that I never thought that was gonna be a thing though I didn't think you were gonna be able to play as past Link cannot. You cannot. Definitely cannot. Poor Agro's dead. <laughs> when I, I enter is like really close to backspace, so if like if I screw up and I try to hit backspace and I hit enter. I don't know why they put enter so close to backspace on so many phone keyboards. Never ends well. <laughs> I'm gonna do the motorcycle again. Do you lose horse gear if it dies? No, you never lose the horse gear. You can put you can put the same horse gear on all your horses. Like, I still have the ancient bird on saddle. Right now. And you can, like, put it all on all your horses. If you want. If you so please. Whoa! Boing! Love this so much. Oh, shoot. I tried to glide for some reason. Master Cycle, no! Just spawn a new one. <laughs> but see, all those puddles were not there before. This place becomes basically a giant swamp. Oh my gosh, it's just like Twilight Princess when you go through the water. It starts killing the frame rate. What's up with Nintendo and they're going through water? <laughs> frame rates in their games. What? That wasn't that deep. What's that? 
Dude, I never knew there was a wizard guardian around these parts. I always thought there was just a couple of uh, big guardians. And that was it. That's cool. That's annoying. Sometimes the water is deep enough to make you disappear. There's another deck on the bike. The headlight effect is very impressive, you're right. I really like it. It works actually as intended, it really helps me see what's in front of me. Doesn't look as cool as I wanted it to. Dang it. <laughs> I love looking behind me and just seeing what I hit. Just think all the things. Oh, that was a bit too hard. <laughs> all right. What else can we do? That is awesome. I love. Thanks for suggesting the. Uh... The f uh, flurry rush midair thing. Because that that turned out perfectly. Let's see, what else can I do with it? What other crazy things? Huh. I can find the rest of these stuff. What is the point to upgrading the Master Sword? Just more damage? Yeah, just more damage. That's the only thing. It is just more damage. So there's still two more parts. Uh, dining Hall, near the Dining Hall, Guard Chamber, and just generally on the second floor. We can find that in the uh, Hyrule Castle. Garb of Winds. This Minoite River. There is no Minoite River. I swear to God, there is no Minoite River. I looked absolutely everywhere. I'm looking at Minoa River. Does it last longer or recharge quicker? Those two, I can't be certain of. I'm pretty sure it doesn't recharge quicker because at least it wouldn't recharge qu any noticeably faster because I haven't noticed anything faster. And I think it does last longer though. I feel like it does. I used to think that it lasted forever, but when I actually when it actually destroyed, I guess I I just never thought about it. If it did last longer or not, I just assumed that it lasted the same amount, but it might actually last longer. I can't be sure about that. But I always assumed that when it was at 60 damage, when it does 60 damage, uh, like normally, like without power powering it up, like by doing the uh, thing to upgrade it, uh, I always thought it didn't break ever. But may so maybe maybe in those situations where it would be lit up. I don't know. I can't be sure. But I'm gonna look up Minoit River. Minoit River, Breath of the Wild. Okay, I'm just gonna have to look up. Specifically, oh, I misspelled it. It's it is a location in Breath of the Wild, apparently. Located in the Faron region. What? Where in the Faron region? Floria River. Dracozu River. What 
where? <laughs> okay. I've been searching at the base of the Minoite River. Where where is the Minoite River? What? Very western end of Cora Lake. I'm confused. <laughs> It doesn't wear out if you hit guardians. That's a thing. All right. It probably just appears so it lasts longer, honestly. Oh man, I'm feeling pretty hungry right now for some lunch. I might stop streaming soon. Treasure chest nearby. All right. I don't know where Minoet River is, but that was weird. Ah, sorry about that. I had to sneeze, so I muted. Whoa. Is dragon coming through? I might go in a bit to eat. I might stream from Star Citizen. No idea what Star Citizen is. What is it? What kind of game is it? Oh, yep, there it is. What? What are you doing over here? Is it in here? No. Wait, that's Kalora Lake, not Cora Lake. Wait, there's no Cora Lake. You might be talking about Quarter Lake. As well. So I've seen it's a space game, it has real 3D spaceships and a physics space. Like FPS, real ship combat. Very realistic, but yes. This sounds pretty cool. 
Can I go up that waterfall? I doubt it. Does not look like a waterfall I could go up with the thing, but I'll still try. I can. All right. Still fun at the same time. That sounds fun. That works, uh, but PC only. Ah. A lot of games are like that. Annoying if you ask me. I like playing games on the big screen. Realic ver realistic version of Elite Dangerous, if you ever heard of that. Never heard of Elite Dangerous before. I'm a pri pri primarily Nintendo gamer. I've been trying to get into Sony. Sony is also pretty dang good, but I don't have the money for that right now. So especially PC stuff I don't really hear about. Generally. Aha! Uh -huh. How did I not see that before? Why? What? I'll take it. Alright, so what does it do? I wonder. What? No! Oh, that was that it? Come on! Maybe he was talking about a different lake. Now I have this little nook to stand on. Good. I just have to move it a little bit so I can stand right here. Waiting for the load. There we go. Now I can really get rid of it. That thing's not coming back anytime soon. Or not. Jesus Christ, that thing has to be heavy. <laughs> cool. No. Yes, hold it at the bottom of the ocean. That's gonna be helpful. Is this it? It looks like it. Yeah, it's it. The yes, chest. Wait, what? I tried streaming Breath of the Wild yesterday, but it looks bad. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Maybe something with the capture card. What capture card are you using? Or your laptop isn't powerful enough to process the footage. I tried using my friend's laptop, but it, uh, to stream this game, and my third friend too, it did not go well. Like, I have a bunch of episodes recorded, but I, when I rewatch the episodes, I'm like, oh, these recorded horribly. <laughs> I did not know. This is not what I was looking for, but I'll take it. A different EX chest. Ah! 
Yeah, Adam. All right. So, is there any lake called Cora Lake? Just Cora Lake. Ah, right here. Found it. And there's Minoite River. Found Minoite River. No idea. No idea how I didn't see that. Oh God! Oh God! sixty. Okay, yeah, that's what I have too. So I think it is the laptop then. I love how I accidentally found a different EX chest. Completely accidentally. There we go. Island lobster shirt. Here of the winds once wore this shirt on a quaint island they call he called home. They say he wielded the wind and traveled the ocean wide. It's a rather rare find. Alright. Sweet. Now how much is it like people always compared it to the champion's tunic? It does have the same exact shade of blue. Well, actually, the Wind Waker one is slightly darker. That does look pretty cool. Funny thing about... But I did have a bigger problem with the Switch t-shirt than I do with the bike. What's that? They, oh, that, it's, yeah, it doesn't fit in with the universe at all whatsoever. That's true. It is really weird. I think the same thing. It really takes it out of the universe, but it's fine. Yes, sir. It doesn't need to be correct, but that doesn't look as good. I, I thought it would look just as good as with Champions Tuning on. What does it change to? What is it? What's it effect? What's its effect? Heat resistance. That's all right. Uh, Phantom Ganon stealth up. Insi inspired by a dark entity resembling the Great King of Evil himself. It's a rather rare find. All right. So what else do we have here? Dark armor, real guard rumors. Okay, and that's it. That's all we have to do left, and then we'll, we're pretty much done with all the DLC. That's ah, uh, I almost want to say that's ever going to come out with the game, but the Explorer's Guide to Breath of the Wild said uh, to get that season pass thing to get the first two packs. DLC packs. Describes them as the first two. Why would they describe them as the first two if there aren't going to be more? Right? It's the only two. You know? It seems redundant to say the first two if it's the only two. So, 
I say there's going to be more. None of the DLC outfits are upgradable? No. None of them are upgradable. Sadly. I have the Roy Guard boots. That's all I've found so far. I'm really hungry right now. I gotta go and eat, but I have the uh, two more parts to Phantom Ganon and two more parts to Royal Guard. And after that, I'm done. I'm done with the DLC. Pretty much. That's a shame. That that's all I have to do. That's all we have left to do in the game. It took me so long to do the story DLC, though. I, I'm telling you, I. I started playing it the moment I got home from school yesterday at 3 o'clock. I had a little bit of breaks here and there for food. But other than that, I was playing until 1 o'clock in the morning before I finally went to sleep. And I wasn't even done yet. I finally finished this morning. There was still a lot more to do this morning. I, I started playing at 7 o'clock this morning, too. I've been playing the whole time. I, I stopped to have breakfast, but that's it. And now it's noon. So it's probably time for me to get off anyways. <laughs> oh, it's a shame that you can't upgrade the outfits. Okay. But it's a shame that that's all the DLC left for the game. That is a lot of content. And that's not even including the Trial of the Sword stuff. Like, if that all came out at the same time, all this DLC, this is well worth $20. All this stuff. Well worth $20. Can't use that on the towers, damn. Well, you'll start a new file, start a file to, for the DLC. Should you start a new file? Okay. Let's see. Um, I'd say, sure, yeah. That seems like a really good idea. Um, play in master mode, and then you can find all this. You can find all the other stuff along the way, all the outfits and stuff. You can find the uh, journals that tell you where they are and stuff along the journey, rather than teleporting there. It would be a lot more of a journey. Yes, definitely. Start new file. I'd say that would probably be the best way to experience it. Oh shit! What the fuck? What happened? What was that? Just get rid of him. <laughs> I'm not sure how that happened. I just started shield surfing. The bike disappeared and I started shield surfing. Alright, well, I gotta go and eat now. I'm gonna go make myself a sandwich. Probably. Is master mode worth it? Um, is just to pull all your hair out mode. Okay, so I'm. I can't give you a full uh, explanation on whether or not that's gonna happen because I haven't finished it yet. I'm doing I'm doing a playthrough of it, and I'm I've beaten two to two of the divine beasts so far in it. I'm doing another episode of it soon. But at the very start of it, yes, the very start of the the Great Plateau section, it's it's very difficult to get through the Great Plateau. Because if you remember, on the Great Plateau, when you encounter Blue Bacovans, it was like the hardest thing to kill them with the stuff you had. Now, it's just all Blue Bacovans, with some occasional Black Bacovans. That is insanely hard. Basically, it's avoid. The, it, the Great Plateau is avoid enemies at all costs <laughs> mode. 
but like the rest of the game, like the things it adds in the uh, the flying platforms and stuff, it's it's fun. It's very fun. Uh, I haven't encountered any gold enemies yet because I uh, I have not encountered any of them yet. I I, mean, I can't wait to encounter them, but you'll pass on master mode. All right, because if you want to get the full DLC experience, you play through the game in master mode as well as seeing everything else. But yeah, if you don't want to do it, that's fine because there's that first DLC pack also added in the uh, whole trial of the sword thing. That'll be fun. Like usually, like the mo the moment you get off the, uh, how do you back up your save? Uh, I wouldn't. Uh, if like if you were doing master mode. If you're doing master mode, uh, you wouldn't have to back up the save because it's a, it's a separate save file for that account. But honestly, what I would do is I would just make a new Switch profile. Unless you don't, do you have do you play it on the Wii U or Switch? I just realized I never, I don't know. But I would make a different profile and play it in a different profile. If you don't want to lose your old save, because you can't back up saves. Wii U. Ah, uh, so, uh, yeah, I'd say, uh, make a new profile and play it on a new profile, I guess. I can't be certain how it works on the Wii U version, though, if it works any differently. But that's what I would do if I were you. And I wanted to play a normal mode, but start at the beginning for the DLC. Because honestly, I kind of wish I, I kind of wish I did in a way. Like, but I love it. The moment you get off the plateau, just you start getting so many side quests for the DLC. That's what happened to me when I did Master Mode, my Master Mode playthrough. So yeah, you're welcome. That was fun actually, testing all that stuff out. I might not have done so much testing if you hadn't suggested a lot of stuff, so thank you for suggesting that stuff. Alright. So that's it for the stream. I'm gonna go eat a sandwich. I'll probably be back later with a friend, and we'll play some other video games. Probably on and streams. So all the DLC starts when you get off the plateau. Yeah. I mean, unless you're doing master mode, which obviously you start off on the plateau with. Just instantly. Not all of it. Uh, some of it. Some of it you'll get later. Some of it you'll get, yeah, get at certain points. Throughout the adventure, but... Most of it, like... Like the outfits that you can find in the EX chests, you basically just get tons and tons of like hints on where they are and stuff coming in. The moment you jump off, so that's that's basically it. Stuff like the story DLC that doesn't come till much later in the game. So yeah, you're welcome. All right, goodbye. Don't die for the next video, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.